Well, guys and girls, generals, welcome to Conflict of Nations Weekend Update. I know it's been a hot minute since I've been on uh, and done a video, but I wanted to just let you know I'm in two games this weekend. Um, probably going to add a third here soon as these are kind of, well, the one's kind of closing out. Let's get to it. So, so I decided to play a Rising Tide. Still not a huge fan, um, but uh, it's been crazy. I, I don't know the breakouts. I don't know the countries and all that stuff. So anyway, the, the three of us jumped in here. And by the three of us, I mean um, Asian David and Ice Pizza, two of the most active guys I know to play with uh, here in the summer times. And so I uh, I got into a fight earlier with whoever this cat was down here, the Marathi Nation. Uh, I'm Hindustan. And then Tamil Cam got into it also with Marathi, but then Pakistan came down out of nowhere. I don't know what they were thinking, man, to be honest. So so they just uh, decided to fly on through here and cause some, some trouble. I had to get back one of my towns, then Tim Lacan quit, and uh, and I just started to take over. So so I'm behind in this game. I'm behind in my arms industries. I'm behind in everything. And you get to, <laughs> that's just pitiful, 252. And these cats are up at like 1655 and 1142. They just had all the easy work. I had to fight everybody. Dang. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and take this little bit of land down, cha, and uh, I'm going to leave one dude up there and then just kind of take all this land. It's weird, isn't it? Like, Sri Lanka, this whole island is like two squares in a regular game. I don't get yeah, I don't understand it, man. I don't like all these fancy pants games. I don't even know how I'm going to break this up to get down here the quickest. I go through these mountains. Daggone, daggone. Let's do this. Let's come across. So let's go here, and let's go there, and then come back down. Ah, see, it just backtracks. I don't care. I ain't got time for it. It's a 4X. Them janks gonna get around there anyway. They're gonna get around there. So, uh, so anyway, take a few more pieces of land. I don't know where to go, to be honest. Um, they've pretty much shored up this area up here. Me sending troops up here is not gonna... Well, am I sending troops up there? I guess I kind of am. But I don't really need to. I mean, to be honest, I could probably just come down to Malaysia, Singapore... I mean, they're gonna handle all this area up here, and they're already taking Japan, so they've got like they got planes and stuff. I got troopers level three. That's just sad, man. Or maybe I should just back up to hit the, whoever this is right here, Trans Caucasian, Trans Caucasian, <laughs> Trans Caucasia. I don't know. It sounds like a guy that used to be a girl, white girl. Um, ASAP fifty six. He's got twenty seven though, man. I don't want to mess with dude. Four oh four. I don't know who to go after. Look at this Indonesia guy at 550. He must be holding on to... Let's take a look at Indonesia. Why is Indonesia holding so many VPs? I don't know. I don't know why Indonesia is holding so many VPs. Because they're just down here, right? No, that's Australia. Australia took them out. Good job. There's Indonesia. And that's it. Oh, they must have just lost this stuff. That's why. All right. Well, I'm just gonna hold tight, man. I'm gonna I'm gonna fortify and then uh, raise these players up, player. Look at that. I seriously have zero research done. Should I just go right into? I should probably just go right into um, rail guns for defense. They did nerf them though, man. Let me just double check them real quick. They're still pretty lethal, man. But I think they don't shoot a hundred. Yeah, they only shoot seventy five. So I have to. I have to pair them up with rockets. Uh, what do I do? Let's just go ahead and do it. I don't want to labor over that decision too much. But now let me check my build times. And you can see how far I'm behind I am on here, man. I'm just behind on everything in this game. Because these yam heads tried to come in here and take me out earlier. So these are going. All these buildings I got. Oh, this is the one that I need. Yeah, this is the one that I need because I don't I don't have anything for... Um... Oh, man. Dang it. I want to use my gold. Is there anything for sale? There's nothing for sale. There's not even anything for sale. Come on, man. Um, there's no sense in selling. Oh, oh, oh. There's really not a whole lot of anything for sale. So I'm gonna have to gold in this uh, this arms dealer, <laughs> arms industry, to get them going because I'm so far behind on electronics, man. Uh, I need electronics for some of my higher end stuff. So. So let's just go ahead and pull these forces back. Um, I'm going to pull these guys back over to here. Get them going. Those guys are good. I'm going to keep this guy on the shore. On the shore. i got to produce like some sort of a boat defense. Something or other. 
I have a feeling that when they attack, I'm going to be the guy they attack on here anyway. So, uh, so anyway, that's my plan. I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, and jump on rails, get those going, and then I think I'm going to come back over here on the MRLS multiple rocket launchers because they do fire so so far a hundred on here will hit any ships that come by the only problem is i might not see subs but then i can go and grab radars no i think i'm gonna do that so my my setup would be rail guns for air defense and then it would be ground troops for taking land rocket launchers and MRLS, or all the same thing, but, and radars. Yeah, I think that's going to be the deal. This game right here is just a giant mess, to be honest. Um, <laughs> I mean, we're winning, and I'm winning considerably, but you know who else is doing some winning is these rogues, man. Indonesia's pumping up on me. Let's, oh, oh, it's laggy, laggy. Yeah, so they're trying to come, they're trying to roll up, but that's all right. We're going to take these guys out. Um, I've got to leave people in all these little cities because they're all smoking, like, all over the place, man. Like, I'm just at war with too many people, and uh, it's a mess. So let's go ahead and, can we move in and take this? I kill so many civilians that it's hurting my morale overall. People hate me. I took my boats and bombed, like, the shores of everything, and, and it just, it really hurts morale, like, all over the place. You can see, like, there's literally, literally... What's going on down here in Sweden? Uh, they're still fighting those guys. But see, I'm going to be hitting civilians in there too. By the time I take it over, they're still going to be angry at me, man. I'm going to have to come in and build... Um, looks like this town's empty. I can pop in there. I got to leave troops in all these little cities because they're going rogue all over the map. But we're running. We're running. And like this guy has a bomber in here. He's got an airfield, Venezuela. He just won't quit, man. Um... Yeah, it's just a mess. I've got to leave people in all these cities so it takes me longer to get around the map. And then, of course, stealth bombers. I don't think I need them right now. I don't think there's anything showing on the map. Uh, let's get these guys moving. See, but that's my only infantry guy. I don't have any spare infantry because I can't get these cities high enough. Like, the city doesn't forget, man. When you bomb out all their buildings and their citizens, they just, they're just angry. They're angry. But we hold the top spots, and we should be pretty close to win. I got almost 2,000 VP. And, I mean, United States and Bol Bolivia, I'm sure, is AFK. But I don't want to add another war person on there. I'll show you what I mean on my cities. Like, the morales are so low on here, man. Look, a 21. And when I hover over there, it's because I got a minus 22 on civilian casualties. And I'm at war with six nations. So I was trying to tell the guys in Discord, hey, get on these smaller ones, right? Like, get on... Indonesia, knock them out because we're at war with them. New Zealand's got 10 VPs somewhere. Knock them out so that we're not at war. Greece has a one. Get Greece out. I don't even know where Greece has another. Greece just has some random VP somewhere because there's nothing over here where he was. So he's hiding somewhere with one VP and I can't find him. Like there's nothing at war here. There's no piece of land that's available. How do I search what Greece where Greece is like are they they've got to be like way out here on some other continent that's Venezuela 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 US I mean I don't know where Greece is hiding at man let me see is it Hawaii no I mean these are New Zealand here we got to get to that one and we got to finish off these last two and then New Zealand I think will be Audi 5,000 but that's all Indonesia, Indonesia. I'll have them out in, in a day or so, but the game will probably be over. I just don't know where Greece is at, man. They got like Diego Garcia or something down here. No, that that's us. That's Kenya. Nothing in there, nothing in there, nothing down here at war. I think the game is lying. Anyway, that's the two games this weekend. I appreciate you guys watching the video. Any questions, hit me up in the comments. We love to talk about it and debate it. My Discord is in the description, so watch it there. See you.